So the rugby ball, uh, we were approached by the council, uh, I think it was around Christmas time. Uh, they wanted to do something really sort of spectacular to uh, put themselves on the map as a host city for the World Cup. Uh, and between us we sort of threw, threw around some ideas and uh, well here we are today with a, a giant rugby ball crashing into the side of, a, of Cardiff Castle. Uh, the ball's made out of fibreglass uh, predominantly. Uh, it's got a pretty hefty steel frame in the middle of it uh, and then the rocks around it are uh, a foam of sorts uh, that are cast from a mould that looks exactly like the castle. Uh, installation. Over, over a course of 24 hours we did a lot of the sort of behind the scenes stuff, uh, putting the, the ballast and the, the steel support on top of the castle uh, about this time yesterday and then we started doing the, 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 the main rigging of the ball and the debris at uh, about 10 o'clock last night so that it was all under the cover of darkness so that it was a nice surprise for everybody when they woke up this morning. It's you know it's great. It's just fantastic to see. I think I think just to have people in Cardiff seeing something like this, and you know, it's, it really puts Cardiff on the map.